Hey everyone, welcome back to Tomb Raider 2. Last time we went climbing up a giant shaft. Oh, great. Ten seconds into the video and we've already had a rude joke. Who cares? Let's carry on. Welcome back to Tomb Raider 2. We are currently in the diving area. And last time we did climb up the giant shaft. And we also found a blue pass card, which we are going to use right here in order to progress with the level. Hopefully nothing bad happens. But I shall get me guns out just in case. What's this? Is this like an airlock or something? I think so. Oh! Right. Is there anything the other way? No. Okay. Oh, there's dogs this way though. Out of my way, doggies. Oh my god, there was four of them. Okay, I thought there was only two. Who's that fella? Oh my god! Fire! Don't run into him, woman! Wow! Okay... Okay... <laughs> well, we're probably going to need to go into that with a little bit more health and probably some better guns. Huh... Okay... Well, let's get the good guns out then. Actually, how many Uzi bullets have I got? Hmm, not enough that I'm happy to use them. Okay. Okay. Fine. Okay. Well, now we know he's there. Now we know he's there, we can prepare adequately for the situation. And I think we'll be able to get away with a small medikit. This time I'm going to save right as the door's opening as well. So we just, just to save us a bit of time, really. Because I'm imagining we may die a few more times on this. Where are them dogs at? There they are. And then these dogs come in from behind. And we don't want to go too far that way because this fella has a flamethrower. Got him! Yeah! And that is how you kill a man with a flamethrower. Alright, and now we get the dramatic music. <laughs> This music is a bit misplaced. <laughs> Alright, well the flamethrower guy doesn't have anything on him. So, then never mind. Let's just carry on around this way, making sure we're ready at all times in case there is more things to be aware of. I think we're going to have to open that door with the valve on it. Oh, there is this door with a valve on it as well. And when we get back to here, this should be back where the dead dogs are. Yes, it is. Okay. So let's put the guns away. And we'll start with this door here. For no real reason. Other than this is the one I have come to. Nice and slow. We don't want to cause any trouble. But we don't want to move too slowly either. Because we're making videos here. We need to be, we need to be on our toes keeping things moving and entertaining. Oh, we can't even go that way. Fine. Unbelievable. Looks like we've got to go through the other valve door then. Not what I was hoping for. Guns out just in case more men have appeared. They tend to do that sometimes. They just randomly spawn every now and then. What's through door number two? Ah, this one goes down. Hoi! Hoi! <laughs> no good for you, sir. You have had a bad day. Did he give us anything? No? Tight. Okay. So then how do I get in here? Because he ain't going to open the door for me. That much is certain. Um, what do I do with this? Do I push this over here? Oh, hello. What are you? You're like a circuit board or something. No. We don't have any circuitry for that. So. Shall we... Uh, oh wait, hang on. Let me check. Is there anyone in there? 
looks safe just in case we fall okay so we can't make that is there anything going on in here oh yeah look at this what's up here oh I hear men oh there is a man oh there is a man not what I wanted to see or hear and he's just gonna pilfer me while I mess around with all this okay because I haven't got enough harpoons to deal with these guys because the game's been a bit stingy on harpoons thus far can I pull that quick before he comes and before I run out of air please okay so that does that oh now the camera's changed angle so I think we have to go this way look at this oh right that leads us back here the wrong way okay round this way Fortunately, I think the fellow with the harpoons is trapped. Okay. Hopefully, he will pursue us all the way. Oh, I can't get out. I can't get out of here. Okay. Oh, yes, I can. Yes, I can. That's fine. Panic over. But as I was saying, hopefully he's pursuing us. So if he's pursued us into here, we'll be able to pop him with real guns. That would be really useful. Because how many harpoons have I got? Four. So even if I... I think even if I managed to hit him with all four of them, that still wouldn't be enough to get him. Which sucks. Okay, let's save. And I think I missed a turning down there, so we should have another investigate down there, just in case there's something else. I can hear him breathing. Oh, go. Okay, so nothing up there. If we snake around here, then we have that. Which leads us around to here. No, there was no turning. It was literally just that. Oh, and once you've been through, you can't actually go back again. Fine. Looks like he's still pursuing us, though. But hopefully we won't actually have to come back down here ever again anyway. Jesus. Okay. Let's get out of here and return to that other valve door that we opened. In an attempt to progress with our level here. Because it looks like that's something we can do now. Guns out just in case. That's the general rule of thumb I've found for this game. Guns out just in case. That's the trademark. Because you have never got a clue when you're going to run into trouble. And trouble who never has a clue when it's going to run into you. Okay, so here we are. What's this? Oh! I need better guns, really, because that man... Uh. Uh. Okay. Jolly good. Oh, look, and we got bullets for that gun as well. Now I need to try and turn this alarm off somehow, because I don't want that playing the whole damn time. I don't want people knowing I'm here, but people do know I'm here. Never mind. Is there a way to turn it off? Maybe there's a way in here. Like a lever or something. There's a fire extinguisher. That's no good to me. Oh, okay. This looks like an area I need to save for. <laughs> it looks dangerous. If I pull that lever, what does it do? It turns the fire off. Oh, it turns that fire off. Oh, look, and the circuit board's up there. And then this button does the other fire. But I wouldn't mind betting that these are only on timer. And they will come back on. Boom, 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 boom. Yes, okay, so we need to be quick here. So what I'm thinking is we need to pull that and then do ourselves a double sideways jump, sidestep, push the button, sideways jump, and peg it. Oh, hey! <laughs> Not today. Uh -huh. And they... Oh. 
I don't even know what's down there, but I don't think I want to know. Do I want to know? Sure, let's have a look. Oh! Well, that looks very useful. Very useful indeed. Of course, now I will not be able to make it back without setting myself on fire. Fire extinguisher! <laughs> okay, so we know that we want to find time to go down there. Because there's another gun there. And it looked like a very good gun as well. If I recall correctly, that gun is the M16. We'll get it on the way back. Use the roll to get a bit more distance. And that should give us a little bit more time as well to do things. So let's get in there. Pick up the gun. Get up and out. And before the fire comes... Oh, the fire's back on. Damn that. You have got to be quick. No, wait. No, you don't. I am a moron. So what you do is you just do that. Just do the one. Simple. And then do. Okay, or, or mess it up entirely. But that's what you do. You just do the one. Do the one, for, do the one thing for getting the gun. There we go. Now. Now we can do it both. Okay, I can't flip that just now. So, let's have a look at that. Is that. Yeah, that's number six. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. Got loads of range on that. Looks great on her back as well. Wonderful. Saving. Flipping the lever. Gonna press the button after our double jump. Hoop. Hoop. Over we go. Push the button. And then leg it in a more sensible fashion than that. Use the roll to get us forward, pick up the circuit board, what it's actually doing down here in the first place I have no idea. And there we go. Bish bash bosh. Well done Lara. So that helicopter was an interesting phenomenon. That flying out of the way there. Not quite sure why that helicopter was here, where it was going in such a hurry. Maybe we should have tried to get on it. If we'd have been quicker we might have been able to grab onto it and get off of this damn oil rig. However, that probably means we would also cut out half the adventure, which does also mean we would miss out on absolutely tons of secrets, which we don't want. No, we do not. So the circuit board goes into this room here. Straight into that circuit we unveiled right here behind the box. The machine chip. I am going to sneeze. Bear with me. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> okay, so what did that machine chip do? Hmm. I don't know. I don't think I can pull this up here, can I? No. Um. Uh, so that is still unattainable. Um, well, maybe, have I got to put, push this back in front of it to kind of like wedge it in? Oh no, whoa, 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 when did this open? Was this what the machine chip did? Oh, maybe. There's a fella there. No time for you. Oh my god, there's a fireman as well. Okay, well, thank God I leapt into here when I did. Mind you. How on earth am I supposed to deal with this now? Because as soon as I get out, he's just going to incinerate me and then I'll catch fire again. Doesn't help that that thing has such a huge range on it. And uh, nuts. Where did I last save? doing this. Alright, I'll see you uh, see you back at that room. Now we know what to expect. It shouldn't be so bad. Right. Let's save here this time. Save. And how was I doing for health? Oh, I'm sure that'll be alright. Who knows? Let's see. 
So he's not who I should be after, really. It's the fire guy that should be my cause for worry. Oh, that didn't work. What I was trying to do was trying to lure him back so that we can fight him up here in the corridor or something instead. Just try and take him one at a time. Okay. <gasps> Ha 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 ha! Suck it, fire guy! No time for you today, because you suck! Jeez. Who thought fire, fire th flame throwing men would have been a good idea, eh? Right? It's a rubbish idea. Just a nightmare to deal with. More harpoons over here, though, which is good. Oh look, a double set as well, that's really good. Okay. So down here, I guess, is where we're next headed off to. So let's have a nosy and see. Weak. Oh, that was a failed dive because I hit caps lock instead of shift. So there's a thing there or a tunnel here. I guess we're heading down the tunnel here. No. Oh. Do you know what? No. No time, just let's deal with it. Let's just swim. Oh my god, that is super deep. I'm going to need air before I go and tackle that for sure. Oh my god, I can't get out. Okay, let's just run then. Or swim quick. Oh, maybe that's where I get out right there. Oh wait, no, look, here we are. Look, we can get out here as well. Okay, that'll do us. Just get out of the water for now. Oh look, they, I didn't know they could shoot harpoons out of the water as well. Alright, alright, pack it in, you killed me! <laughs> die, die! God, jeez. Okay. So now we know that they can shoot out of the water, we know not to mess around so much up there. So let's head straight to that area, we'll get the good guns out and deal with these guys ASAP. Because then I have a feeling that we're going to need to swim straight down at some point, so... Oh that's not what I wanted at all, that is not going to be good, that is not good. Oh there's spears flying everywhere, that did not hit me, go home! Oops. Yo, maybe you could aim at the guy shooting harpoons into your kneecaps. Christ. Oh, uh, there's another one down there. Look, I can see the bubbles coming up. Right. Oh, hello, fella. Come on. Come round, son. What's he doing? Mug. Oh, there's a lever up there. That's it, Lara. Pummel him! Good girl. Yeah, then bubbles are still coming. Let's go for the lever. See what pulling this does. Uh, okay, so that deals with that. If I save now, we're going to wrap up this episode by trying to swim to the bottom of this. See how far down it is. Oh, there's the harpoon fella. This is so deep. Oh, look at this. This is like a giant freaking submarine thing. Uh-huh, okay. Nothing else of interest though. So it looks like we just need to head back out whilst at all times dodging Mr. Harpoon Man because we have no business dealing with him and I am not a whale, therefore we don't need to interact with him. Don't know what this grate in the ground is for, maybe we'll find that out at some point. Possibly in the next episode because I am going to get to that area that we need to be in, which is not this way. 
Who are you? Who are you? Yeah, or the man who's right next to you, girl! Gosh. She has not got targeting priorities. Where are they? Right, that's him gone. Oh, and this one has a gun. Get out of here. Right. So, let's try again. Let's pick up this this here, because uh, God knows I need health kits. What are we doing? Six, five, let's have a six. We'll go and see what the other fella had over here. Oh, look, he's got Uzi clips. That's useful. Wonderful. Oh, for... Well, we've probably got to go back this way, so I should get rid of him, really. No time for you. Go home. Okay. So, I think I'm going to get into this room here. Because this looks like a safe place to rest. So, I will see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed it, please feel free to give the video a thumbs up and maybe leave a comment as well. And maybe you could even subscribe if you haven't done so already as it really helps out the channel a lot. And I appreciate all of your support. See you in the next episode, everyone. Bye-bye. That looks dangerous.